Hey girl, welcome back to the vlog. My name is Jasmine. If you're new here, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. Today's Tuesday. Just got ready to head to the city. I'm going to the Blue Box Cafe, which is basically like the Tiffany's Cafe for breakfast at Tiffany's. I'm so excited. I've been trying to get a reservation for this place for months it's so hard to get a reservation i literally was like scrolling through all the comments on their instagram to figure out like how to get a, re a reservation and finally i saw somebody comment that you have to do it at 12 a.m um and then you have to book it like almost a month in advance so about a month ago around 12 a.m i secured today's date for our brunch so i'm really excited it's gonna be like a little tea date i guess i did film a get ready with me on tiktok and reels so you'll see that there maybe i'll put it on shorts as well or jewelry i did switch out my jewelry today i'm wearing my tiffany's necklace i figure you know why not <laughs> and then i'm wearing this bracelet from tiffany's which i got uh, i think like my 20th birthday or 21st 20th i think birthday since we're doing silver i threw on this ring from david yurman and then i also found this silver bracelet so yeah, just threw on some silver pieces. I don't really wear a lot of silver. I actually could not find a single bag with silver accents. So the bag that I have with the least amount of accents is my Speedy. So I'm going to wear it because this is literally the only bag that I have that has, besides my big tote, my um, Marc Jacobs tote doesn't really have um, a gold or silver, but it's like... I don't really want to wear that. I also feel like this is a classic bag and it just reminds me of like breakfast at Tiffany's. So I think it's, you know, vintage. So I'm going to wear it. It has gold, but very minimal compared to all my other purses that are just like covered in gold hardware. So I don't know if it's worth me getting a silver hardware bag, but I definitely need some bags that don't have a ton of hardware. So that way, even if they're gold, it's not so much that it's like overpowering my jewelry if that makes sense i also wore my tiffany perfume I'm trying to be create a vibe okay so i'm wearing this i don't really wear this too often because it's not one of my favorites but i mixed it today i mixed it in with this perfume and together obsessed i'm gonna put some of this on my hands we need to leave the house in two minutes it's 10 58 we want to leave by 11 that way we could get down there and get parking our reservations for 12 45 but it's on the upper east side well kind of like mid yeah like midtown upper east side so parking i don't know like i don't really ever park over there like usually i'm parking on the upper west side or downtown so i'm not really sure how parking is on that in that area all right let's see if johnny's ready
Nice. Hey girl, so it's a little later. We just got to Whole Foods. We're gonna do a quick little grocery run, but we left the city. We're in Jersey right now. Um, the Blue Box Cafe was really cute. We did, I did the Tiffany's breakfast, which was like different pastries and it had like um, egg with caviar. I had a little bit of it. Like I just wanted to taste it to see what it tastes like. You guys, I don't know if you know, but I'm, I get like really nauseous whenever I eat eggs and so I haven't eaten eggs in years so I was a little bit nervous about eating it but I just took mostly caviar not really much of the egg it was pretty good Johnny ate the rest of it and then I had some other pastries which were really nice I got a uh, mocktail a lychee mocktail which was really really good and then it came with um like a fruit juice we walked around Tiffany's after I saw some really cute jewelry pieces that I kind of want so I took some pictures <laughs> and then we went to my mom to grab coffee i didn't get coffee at uh tiffany's so i got this vanilla honey um latte it's really really good this is the name this is the name of the place my mom i've had their coffee and their like breakfast a ton at different events but i've never been to the store until today and it's really cute in there it's like earthy it's really nice anyways johnny just went in because he had to use the restroom and i told him i had to update my vlog real quick so i'm gonna go in now and do our quick little grocery run because tomorrow um because tomorrow i have to do my hair so i won't have time and then i have to film after and then thursday i need to do my lashes so yeah i need to organize my schedule because i have a lot of things going on this week but yeah let's go to whole foods from Whole Foods I'm gonna do a quick little grocery haul so we got some stuff for tacos some fish taco seasoning mix we got some of this cheese cotija this is my favorite cheese for tacos then we got some salsa some guac a lime a lime and then I also got this salsa verde because originally I didn't see this one so I ended up getting this one first and I figured I would still try it so yeah that's what we got for tacos and then I also picked up some fish for the tacos so we got some we actually got some salmon and then also some bass I think I'm going to use the bass for the taco I feel like it's going to taste better like a 
it's a white fish so I think it's gonna taste a little bit better and then we got salmon for the rest of the week then I got some and we got some flour tortillas for the tacos and also this mole negro sauce and then for the kids tacos we got these taco shells and then we got some ground turkey which is in this bag here this ground turkey i also got some stuff for the next couple days so i got some potatoes i'm gonna do the salmon with potatoes and then brussels sprouts so i got that for the next day and for the next day i got some um chickpea pasta this is like the protein pasta that i like this one i also like the lentil one so we got this and then i got some chicken breast which is in here for that meal and then i got some bread for clay and some some coffee we just got this cold brew i think we have creamer i really hope we do because i didn't pick any up and then i also got this to try this is a lychee sparkling water i think since i had the lychee uh, martini not martini was it martini i think it was um today i kind of felt like trying this so that's a little grocery haul from whole foods i actually also got a little bracelet which i forgot to show you guys i got this at the coffee shop i thought it was so cute i've actually wanted one of these for a while it's from the little projects brand and this one was the cutest one i've ever seen it says je t'aime and they also had one that said mama on it but i like the colors of this one better it's this company that makes these little beaded bracelets and i think they're so cute This is the kids uh, taco. I don't think it's spicy. It says mild, that means spicy. It's good. Kelly, can you the green? Yeah. Is that bad? Can I what? That's the stuff I play with. No, what? it's not. Let's try it. Mm. This actually tastes good. Mm-hmm. It's even it gourmet good. restaurant. Mm -hmm. Good morning. It's the next day. It's 9.50. I really want to leave the house by 10.30 so I can drive to the coffee shop, get coffee, and then go to the hair salon. Because I'm gotta do. i going to do my hair today. Um, I do need to blow it out first, so I'm going to do that. I've actually been just working on some stuff this morning. I had some things to submit, so I submitted that. I had some stuff to edit, like the little TikTok that I filmed yesterday, so I edited those. And that's pretty much what I've been doing this morning. So I have my hair in this towel, like a hair towel, and then I have this over because this kept sliding off. So... My hair is mostly dried, but I do need to run this blow dryer through it. I'm going to put this in K18 leave-in mask, especially since my hair is going to be braided for the next month or so. So I'm going to put this all in. 
I don't have much of a smell. My hair is completely blown out. I'm gonna just wrap it up. I really want to get coffee first because I'm actually really tired. I don't know why I'm tired because I actually had a good night of sleep, but I'm tired and I went to bed. I went to bed early and I had a good night of sleep, so I don't know why I'm tired, but I'm tired. And I just downloaded, well, I just saved a couple podcast episodes to listen to. I'm listening to Ali. Um, I think his name is Ali Abdul. That's what I want to say. I think I think that's his name. Hopefully when I'm editing this, I'll remember to put something on the screen so you know. He has really good information on his podcast and channel he has a youtube channel i'm pretty sure he has a podcast as well on like spotify or like whatever but i listen to him through youtube i just listen on there instead let's go change out of these pjs two second makeup i just did primer i think i'm gonna do a little no i'm not i'm not i'm not um i'm gonna do my bronzer stick why is this messy all over Oh, that was too much. It's okay. I'll fix it. <laughs> okay. Where's my brush? I did not. Oh, crap. I forgot my brushes. Hold on. All right. Let's do this, y'all. I'm supposed to film when I get home, so I really should not do any makeup because then I'm going to have to take it off and then do my makeup again. But I kind of want to do makeup because I don't know. I don't know. I'm... I don't have a valid reason. Throw something on, look a little put together, I guess. This. I've been really into this MAC foundation. Like, I'm shocked. I'm really shocked. I reach for it literally every time I do foundation. For the most part, that's the only foundation I wore in December. Alright, so just do on some earrings, some lip liner, and we are at the house. Um, it's 10 30 right now, so we're gonna head out to the coffee shop. I don't have a lot of time on my hands, so yeah, we're gonna quickly make our way to the salon. Girl, why did I forget my hair? Why did I just forget my hair? I'm about to go back. <laughs> Girl, just stopped at Roasted. We got our coffee. Yum. I don't know why this is so dark. But anyways, we just got to the hair salon. It's 11.17, so I have a few more minutes before I need to go in. I think I'll go in at like 11.20 something. Um, but this is my first time driving here by myself. The last time I came, I got dropped off. I really couldn't remember what the parking looked like over here, but I should have known. Like, there's always parking. That's one of the things I love about not living in the city anymore. There's always parking. Like, the city, I get anxiety going anywhere, like, just thinking about, is there going to be parking? But, yeah. Anyways, found a spot immediately. Like, there's, like, a million spots here. Y'all, I literally forgot my hair earlier. I had to go back home. Thankfully, I noticed before I left my neighborhood because that would have been crazy. Like, imagine me sitting here, getting my braids done, her asking me for the hair, and all of a sudden I realize I don't have it. But anyways, I'm doing the, I'm getting the Indie Care installed, this um, brand. All right, girl, hair is laid. This looks so good, y'all. Y'all. Y'all, I'm obsessed with my hair. It looks so good. Oh my gosh, my hair looks so good. Girl. Mm -mm. She bodied the uh, curls and everything. Like, she really, she cut it up. Like, she did her thing, okay? I've had sewings before, but nobody ever, like, cut and frame and, like, did all the things that she did. Like, she did that, okay? Like, she did that. I can't get over how good this looks. But anyways, we're going to go to Home Goods. I wanted to see if I could find a painting for my studio, like my office area, because I wanted to put like a, I wanted to put a very simple, minimal painting in the background. So we're going to go look for that at Home Goods. I did find the one for my living room, which I really, really love. I need to get it hung up though. Um, and I need a pink candle. So we're going to check Sephora as well. And then when I get home, I need to film because there's no way I am not filming with my hair looking so good. Like, no. I was low-key. I was kind of like, mm, I don't know if I'm going to film today, but things are being filmed, okay? <laughs> this hair will not go to waste. I'm going to review the e.l.f. stuff. I'm going to 
film like some shorts tiktoks those videos as well because i want to have a mixture also my hair like i can still smell the shampoo from um vegamore that i used last night the shampoo that i used last night from vegamore y'all smells so good and it lasts through all of this the heat everything i can still smell it, it smells so good the sephora all right so sephora did not have the candle that i wanted but we're about to go to the apple store because i need to get um i need to grab a charger because my laptop charger is broken of sephora you did not have what i was looking for home goods also didn't have the paintings i wanted like i want yeah they didn't have it anyways while i was at sephora they had the tom ford perfume so i was like oh let me smell this again because i smelled it at nordstrom last week and i liked it but then i keep seeing people post reviews and everybody in the comments is saying how it smells like this that and the third like cat pee play-doh all these comments today i did a good five sprays on my coke so i'm like i really need to figure out if i like this or not and honestly, I don't love it the way I thought I did. Like, I like it, but I don't love it. I thought I really, really liked it last week. And I think it's because I just did one little spritz and it, I didn't get the full, like, effect of it. But I like it. I just don't think it's worth the price for the smell. Like, when I first sprayed it last week, I didn't really smell the almond as much as I'm smelling it right now. So, yeah. I don't think I'm going to get it. All right, y'all, so I'm back home. I wanted to show you guys what my charger actually looked like because it's crazy. So this is the new one that I got. This USB to USB-C charger from my um, MacBook. And then this. Do y'all see this? <laughs> this is what it was given. I know this is dangerous. This is like, this is definitely a fire hazard of some sort. So yeah, we're going to get rid of this and replace it with this new one. And then I got this hard drive, which I've had one of these before. So this is gonna be my regular hard drive. And then, and this is the one that I use. This is the one I'm gonna use for my sponsorships because it's less storage. I feel like it's appropriate for that. And then the other one has more storage, but I really like this one, but I didn't have it at Apple and I know Lacey's good as well. So I just went with whatever they had available got done filming i don't think i showed y'all my full hair like in full effect <laughs> like you can't i mean this is given grown from the scalp <laughs> just did a first impression of the new elf camo hydrating cc creams i did the shade i'm wearing the shade 540 and i think that shade looks better on me personally and then i also tried the new elf blush this one the camo blush and the elf lip oil um this one here so if you want to see that video it should be up already i'm probably going to upload it on thursday it should be right before this vlog is uploaded but it's 706 right now i already cooked i made salmon potatoes and brussels sprouts for dinner and then i'm going to make Callie some mac and cheese as well because she is probably okay i'm going to make Callie some mac and cheese because that's what she's going to want to eat um I need to clean up my desk because it's kind of messy. I was going to also do an outfit of the day for today's look, but my leggings got some like dirt on them. I don't know if it's makeup or what. It's just like lens and glitter. I guess it's makeup. But um, so I'm not going to do the outfit of the day. So I'm not going to film my outfit, but I'll do it tomorrow morning because I'm going. Oh, no, I can't. I have a lash appointment tomorrow, so I can't do my makeup. Hmm. I guess Friday we'll do an outfit of the day and then I can upload that on Friday because I need to upload something else tomorrow. I'm doing a, I'm uploading a Dove video tomorrow. So yeah, definitely check out my Instagram and support your girl. Any like, comment, and share, save helps. You know, you don't have to help by spending money, but you can definitely help by doing all the above like comment share and save definitely always helps i think i briefly mentioned in the car that i really love the way she did my hair like she oh my god her name is sarah sarah j i'll have her linked below like she does wash hair so you can get your hair washed if you don't have it washed secondly she was quick like she moved really quick she used the net method to just help 
protect and secure your hair some people don't use it but i like it for me because my hair is so thin that i need like a net or something the other girl that i've gone to before she usually does braid in here with your natural hair to help secure it that way but i think i prefer the net because i noticed that it didn't feel as much pull in so she used the net and then um she like styled it so nicely like that's that was the deal that that sealed the deal for me like she really like styled and cut and layered and framed and i was like oh, okay she was doing all this like most i feel like other stylists do that but you would have to like pay extra like sh this was part of my sewing like okay the styling was part of the sewing so yeah definitely if you're in a rockland north jersey area i definitely recommend her and her salon in general the girl who did my braids that when i had the heart and she also did my stitch braids last year her name is kessie she also works in her shop i'm thinking about getting a like refresh midway i don't know how long i should wait to do it i'm gonna probably find out on google like how long i should wait to like have her like wash and like restyle because i typically i've never done that with the sewing but i feel like i should because like usually like a few weeks in i feel like i need a refresh but then i'm scared to do it myself and you know so i think i'm gonna ask her if she can do that for me anyways well i think i'm gonna try to book that also um johnny just came home and he got me this usb c to usb adapter i should have gotten this at the apple store earlier but i completely forgot but um anyways he picked it up from best buy and i wanted this because i can connect my phone to my white microphone which i don't even know where it's at that way i can um that way i can actually connect not only can i connect my mic directly to my computer because that's also an issue i just thought of that actually but i could also connect it to my phone which is the main reason why i got it because i have this little mic that i got from amazon it's all right but i know my other mic is much better so i'm gonna use this to connect to my phone so i could record voiceovers and then also i can use this whenever i'm using that mic with my computer to plug it in directly um i want to say it was like 20 dollars for this so it's not cheap but it's not too expensive because some of these little things be like 60 dollars like girl <laughs> um exhibit a 60 dollars all right, let's go. Okay, this is this is my dinner, and then and I got this to try from. I got this to try. This is the Glow Sparkling Hydration Mango Apricot. So I wanted to try these. I saw this at the supermarket, and I wanted to try it. So we'll try this tonight. Hey girl, it's Thursday. I'm on my way to my endocrine doctor and then I have a lash appointment. So we're just doing errands today. Threw on some lip balm. It's cold. So I just left the doctor's office. I wanted to give like a quick overview of my visit today. Is this thing focused on something else? Like what the heck? Alright, so girl. As of today, I'm one third of my original body weight that I started out at. So that's amazing. Like one third of my body weight. Crazy. Um, he thinks that I have about 10 more pounds to lose before I'll plateau. That's also my goal weight, which I've shared with you guys in the past. Like, and he based that theory on how my weight has been trending over the past few months. So I think um, I'm really excited to hear that that's what he predicts. And that's exactly what my goal is. And I feel like I also know my body pretty well in that sense. So yeah, I literally can believe, I cannot believe I'm at the end of this journey. <laughs> like in terms of the weight loss part, at least like, wow, it's amazing so yeah then we talked about pcos because i was telling him that my cycles have been so regular ever since i started taking with Govi in particular like since august my cycles have been so regular you guys like on the dot they come on the exact same day every month it's not a 28 day cycle but it literally is it's like a 30 day cycle it comes on the exact same date every single month by maybe one day off sometimes but you know some months have 31 days but yeah it's crazy i have not experienced that for a long time and then we talked about um like plans for the medication in the future like long-term use and all that stuff so once we get to like the goal weight um or like you know the plateau i guess we will start talking about 
what the next step looked like and that sort of thing so that's kind of like what we talked about it was a good visit i do have my lash appointment at 12 it's 10 40. actually let me just double check the time of my lash appointment because i think it's at 12 but i want to make sure because next thing you know Yes, yeah, at 12 o'clock. I have about an hour. I think I'm going to go grab coffee. Um, and then uh, we will go to Home Goods again because Home Goods is like in that area and see what we find. I actually thought about getting that. Actually, maybe I should go look for that candle. No, we'll do that a different day. We'll go to Home Goods again. I feel like they probably don't have anything new since I was just there. We'll just see. Oh, I wanted to get some hair stuff. I needed some hair clips because I wanted to um, clip my hair back. At, I wanted some hair clips and then I also need some curlers, like the foam curlers. But there's not really a good beauty supply store. But I don't know. So maybe we'll go to the beauty supply store after I do my lashes. I don't know. We'll see. Because that's what we're going to do. Is there a home goods near me? Oh, this one's in Scarsdale. Should I go? If I go to this home goods, I'm gonna get that 11:30. Like that does not make any sense. All right, I'm gonna go to this home goods. That way. Okay. Starting route to home goods. <laughs> about to oh that scared me <laughs> um and we are about to head to my last appointment it's like 11 i think it's like 11 40 right now i'm gonna go to ulta after my last appointment because i won't have time to go i got my coffee from roasted i just got a latte um really really good it's really good per usual I tried, I did go to Home Goods, you guys. They didn't have anything. Um, I did go to Home Goods, but they literally had exactly what they had yesterday, so nothing new. I figured that would happen, so I don't even know why I went there, but I still wanted to check. And then I just posted on Instagram, I had to post something. I also need to check my menu for the week to see what we're gonna have for dinner today. I think I remember, I think it's chicken, so to double check and if that's the case i totally forgot to put it out this morning so yeah we're gonna have to figure that out <laughs> i'm gonna show y'all the before but this is the after yeah okay back home i'm gonna show you guys what i got from ulta i did stop at lush as well because i needed some soap anyways from ulta we just got a few things i got these jumbo flexi rods these are like the silk kind so I got these. Then I got some of this um, IGK Good Behavior Spray. I really, really like this. I used to use it years ago and I completely forgot about it. But today I was looking for like a smoothing finishing spray and I saw this and I was like, wait a minute. I love this stuff and it smells so good. So back when I used to use it, I also used the leave-in conditioner, which was really good. And a couple other products from this particular line, the Good Behavior from IGK. Yeah. Definitely my definitely my favorite line from them scent wise and product wise. Got some of these clips. These are just styling clips from the brand Kitched. Kitched. Something like that. Oh my gosh, you guys, I found the candle I was looking for yesterday at Sephora. They had it at Ulta. I didn't even realize they carried Nest, but I wanted a pink candle, so this is what I picked up. And then I got a couple brushes. I got this brush. So I needed a new brush for my hair, so it's not focusing. Hmm. Okay, so we got this one, and then I got this one for Cali. So that's my mini Ulta haul. I went to Lush because I wanted to get some soap. <laughs> I don't know why. Like Lush was just the closest place that had soap, and I didn't feel like going to Target. I just wanted to go home, so I went to Lush. I've been using Johnny's men's soap and I just wanted to get my own. So I got this. This is from their new, hold on. 
This is from their new Valentine's Day collection. It smells really, really good. So this is called Passion. It's a shower gel. Then I got their Snow Fairy Shower Jelly. I got two jellies. These are 50% off because this is like a winter um, scent. So I got Kiss Me Quick, which is another Valentine's Day scent or like collection item. This is another shower jelly. I've never tried, I never tried their shower jellies, but she showed me how to use them and it looks cute. It's kind of like a bar soap, I guess. Then I got this container and a body conditioner in here. Ooh, this is the one that I got. It's like a lemony scent. It smells really, really good. So I love the smell. It kind of has like a shea butter scent to it. And then she gave me a sample of Lime Bounty Body Butter. So these two can go really well together. And I'll try it out to see how I like it. So that's what I got at Lush. And then I, it's my coffee, y'all. See, this is how much coffee I drink when I get, never finish it, y'all. I went to the grocery store because I told you guys earlier that I had forgotten to put the chicken out. I don't know if I told y'all, but I, I forgot to put it out this morning. So I went ahead and picked up some chicken because i knew i wouldn't have time to defrost the one that i got at whole foods so i got just a couple of chicken breasts got that and then i picked up some cherry juice i don't know if you guys remember but last year i was on a cherry juice kick for a while it really helped with sleep so i got some cherry juice and i know lately people have been doing like a mocktail with it so i guess i'll try that i don't know i think cherry juice on its own definitely helps me but um but I'll definitely try the mozzo because it looks cute. <laughs> and then I got some sparkling water. This is one of my favorite sparkling water brands, Topo Chico. Really, really good. So that was my little haul from this place. Oh, by the way, I tried these yesterday and I really like them. I got everything from Lush was unhinged, but it smells so good. I can't even lie. It smells so, so good. Okay, so I'm about to start cooking. I want to show you guys my little meal planner that I got on Etsy. So I just wrote everything down in here. Like for Monday, we had this is our menu for the week so far. We had Monday, Tuesday, um, Wednesday. I mostly just put dinner because typically for lunch, like I'm by myself and the kids have their typical like snacks for school, I guess. But yeah, this is what we doing. I have every day filled out except Friday. I have kids pizza. Saturday, I have tuna melts. That's going to be lunch. And then this is Sunday. So yeah today is thursday so we are doing chicken protein pasta and um spaghetti sauce and, and then clay's doing fish and plantain and Kelly's doing rice beans and fruit Good morning. I just got done filming some TikToks. I'm about to let me turn my camera off. I'm about to head out the house because I have a nail appointment. This is the new brush that I got from Ulta yesterday. I tried it out in my little TikTok video and I really like it. So actually I'm gonna add some of this. My new spray. This smells so good, you guys. Like highly recommend. yeah i i didn't try the flexi rods yet because i wanted to film my tiktok before i tried them but i did use a silk hair tie and i wrapped my hair into like a bun to keep the curls that's how i kept them last night and i think it came out pretty pretty nice all right so we need to leave literally like now i need to get coffee first but i wanted to put up my new candle that i got yesterday it smells so good. It smells very relaxing. I think I'm going to keep this little lid on because I'm not going to burn it. And I, I don't think I'm going to burn this, but... Whoop! Oh, mm Whoop! -hmm. Oh, there goes that. <laughs> so, right. I feel like it helps complete. Anyways, I'm going to check my to-do list, make sure I'm not missing anything. 
before I leave the house. You never know. Okay, so nail appointment. Um, I did that, did that. Ooh, I wanted to do... Ooh, hmm, I'm going to do that tomorrow. I wanted to film one more thing, but I'm going to do it tomorrow. Today is pizza day with my kids, so I don't have to cook. <laughs> I'm excited. I'm going to pack my purse with me. Today we're just doing... Um, you know what? I'm going to write down some stuff because there's something I need to do that I know I'm going to forget if I don't write it down. I wanted to stop by Michael's to get paint. Oh, I did write it down. Never mind. <laughs> it's in my to-do list. I wanted to get paint to paint this mirror on the side. So, yeah, we're going to go to Michael's. Hopefully, um, I'm going to hold this brush with me because I feel like it could come in handy in my bag. But also, maybe... I should get another one so I can have one in my house and one in my purse. Yeah. <laughs> On my lips today, because I know somebody's going to ask, I'm wearing a couple things. So first, I'm wearing my brown liner from Makeup Forever. I'm wearing this one. For lipstick, I'm wearing Max Modesty. I know this Makeup Forever lip liner. This is Dimensional Dark Brown. And then I topped it all off with this Fenty Gloss. This was a limited holiday launch, so I don't know if they still have it, but that's what I'm wearing. And then I'm going to go put my pants on because I'm wearing my pajamas right now. Just love the nail salon. Girl, my nails. Oh my God, I'm so excited. I am so excited. Like, they look so good. Let me show y'all. They look... I feel like I need better lighting to show you guys the sun is so bright, but like, they look so good. Oh my gosh, like, I'm obsessed. Um... Do you see the material? So I'm finally done with all my beauty maintenance for the week. I did my lashes, my hair, and my nails this week. I didn't get coffee or any breakfast earlier because I was running a little behind. So we're gonna go grab coffee. I also need to grab some paint. So I think I'll get it at Michael's, I'm not sure. And then we need to pick up something for my mom. So I do wanna go to Home Goods and try to see if I find a painting again. I don't know if I'll go to this Home Goods across the street. This is the Home Goods right here. That's the one I've been going to the, for the past couple of days, and they haven't had anything. So maybe I'll go to a different Home Goods today. Or maybe I can check. Maybe they have like new inventory. But now, why did this man just park his car behind me like that? So the car is probably real loud, but I just did all my errands. I got my coffee. So I went to Ulta because Kendra, who is Kinesthetic Care on YouTube, she DM'd me on Instagram and told me Ulta was having 30% off supplements. She DM'd me because she knew I liked the Lemmy gummies and they were on sale. So they didn't have any Lemmy, like the ones that I wanted. But I found the magnesium I was looking for yesterday. They had it in the front of the store and the actual shelf where it belongs in the back of the store is empty. So that's why I didn't see it. So I definitely got that. I went to Michael's and I got the paints. I got a paintbrush. I checked I did swing by Home Goods and TJ Maxx. Neither of those stores had the painting that I was looking for, so so that's what I just did for the last 30 minutes. Now I'm on my way home because I need to upload a video, and yeah, I'll talk to y'all later. I just let me turn this off. I'm back home. I've been home for a minute, but I had to upload a video, so I was on my laptop doing that work before I turn the camera on but I want to show you guys my nails a little better since we're home now let me just turn down the exposure all right this is what my nails look like this is what my nails look like I am 11 girl okay she really did her thing with these these look so I am 11 I am really just loving this design. I think it's so, so pretty. So those are my nails. I also went to Ulta. And at Ulta, I picked up this magnesium. Um, it's the Berry Calm. It has L-theanine and magnesium, I guess, to help you relax and sleep. So this is it here. Pick this up. Shout out to Kendra for telling me this was 30% off because... We love a little deal. So I got this. I actually thought about getting two, but then I said, no, I'm going to try it first, see how I like it. And then I'll decide from there. So I got this and then I saw these yesterday. I went to get these and they didn't have any. I did find these yesterday, which I like as well. What just fell? I did get these yesterday, which 
I like. I love the uh, style of these. But this is actually what I went for and I couldn't find. Like I wanted just any type of like clip that looked like exactly like this. So now I have both. I'm, that's my mini Ulta haul. And I don't think I went anywhere else. I just got my mom her, um, the dates that she wanted. So it is 5.13. I just uploaded to YouTube. Well, not it's not live yet, but I just uploaded the video. I need to work on the thumbnail description box. And the video should be good to go. I also need to do like the tags and stuff like that. But it's a straightforward video in terms of tags. I'm just trying out the new e.l.f. products. The foundation, the CC cream, the blush, and the the lip oil. So I'm gonna do that. I'm probably gonna post it live at 6:30, so like an hour ish. Yeah. Oh, and then from Michaels, I got the paintbrush. So I got this paintbrush, and then I got this paint for the mirror. So this is like a bronzy color. The mirror that I'm gonna paint is like a silvery color it's like a champ almost it's almost like champagne gold but it's more silver so i want to paint it this color because i prefer this type of look this is what i'm going for and i don't want it to necessarily like be the main character i just want it to be a little bit more gold so we're gonna do that <laughs> some mini videos to edit but honestly i'm probably gonna edit them next week like monday because I have already edited stuff to post throughout the weekend on TikTok. So I don't think I need to edit anything today necessarily. Except the weekly vlog, which is this vlog. I need to start editing because I want to get it up on Sunday. And I don't want to have to, you know, I want to go to church and everything. So I don't want to have to be struggling on Saturday night to edit. So if I don't edit it today, I know tomorrow I'm going to be stressed. And then on Sunday, I'm going to be really stressed because church is from like 11 to... Like one I think and then when I get back home usually we don't even usually we go out to brunch after and then I get home it's like four o'clock and it's just that's not enough time to edit a weekly vlog so yeah I'm gonna start today I do need to do some laundry I also need to submit some files to a brand I can't tell you yet but the video is gonna come out on Tuesday so Tuesday's video you'll see the stuff i have to submit today <laughs> um i'm excited for that video too because i was like oh <laughs> who is she okay um i'm excited about the collab that i'm doing on tuesday you guys will see on Mom, tuesday but listen to this yeah all right so i don't know what i was telling you guys um i was showing clay how to edit something on CapCut, but i yeah we're gonna do the mirror later today oh i was working on my to-do list i think let's make some links for my tiktoks and reels so that way people can access the products because that's something i always suck at when it comes to tiktoks reels and shorts not so, i don't even post shorts like that but like on those two platforms i really am terrible at linking stuff because it's not as i don't know so i need to do some links for the products because people always ask like oh what is this or what brush is this so i'm gonna work on that um i'm gonna work on that tonight i think that's pretty much all i have to do for the rest of the day just editing cleaning ordering food for the kids i don't know what johnny and i are eating yet i'm gonna ask him like if he's craving anything in particular because i don't see like i'm not even like hungry thanks to the coffee <laughs> i definitely need to eat dinner so i need to figure out what we're gonna have or he'll figure it out and yeah it's one of those days where i'm like i don't know what i want you know chili. anyways i think i'm gonna end the vlog here because i don't think there's anything else exciting going on today not that this week was like particularly exciting except the blue box that was really exciting but yeah thank you guys for watching this vlog one of my 2024 resolutions it's to end my vlogs because y'all know i don't mean ending the vlogs they just be ending like <laughs> It would just be a clip of me talking and then all of a sudden the vlog is over. <laughs> but we're going to change that. So thank you for watching. <laughs> thank you for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Let's see.